I think I wish I'd known about uh, just that it was, it takes a long time to do anything um, kind of official, like uh, paperwork or bank or especially with my visa work permit, you have to go to around a lot and do a lot of, kind of jump through a lot of hoops um, and it takes a long time. But um, I, if you have someone helping you, then I think it's manageable. But um, yeah, there's a, kind of a lot of bureaucracy for someone who, if you don't speak the language or you don't really know what you're doing, then it can be a little bit overwhelming. Well, maybe the things that they don't have here that they have in America, like Ziploc bags, are super expensive out here. And they don't have, like nobody eats peanut butter and jelly, so you have to pay like 200 crowns for a jar of peanut butter of Skippy. Um, or Oreo cookies, like just little home comforts that you can't find here. Mm -hmm. So I would have liked to know, and so I could have bought like a huge box before we came <laughs> and stocked up. Just brace for winter, you know? <laughs> just brace yourself for winter. Um, and I wish I would have studied the language a little bit more before I came, honestly. Um, but yeah, just preparing yourself for the winter, and I think it's, it's kind of a big one. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, I wish I'd have known Czech, it would have obviously helped. Uh... I wish I knew how to speak Czech enough so that I could argue back with somebody. <laughs> I wish I knew that I was so bad at language. I, I thought I was bad, but when I got here I realised I was really, really woeful. Um, I think I wished um, that I didn't stress so much. Um, I think I wished that I um, knew that everything would fall into place, I would find a place to live, I would make friends, and I would be able to get my, uh, find my way around the city uh, so quickly, and that would have saved a lot of sleepless nights uh, back in San Francisco.